All right, we're on a, not a, a 2013 Nautic Star 2110 SE, uh, fully loaded, 50 hours or less, how many hours? 48. 48, okay. Beautiful boat, well equipped. Uh, All right, I'm back. I had to change my battery. All right, and say that again. You got, we got full Lawrence equipment on this full vessel. Lawrence. We got Lawrence HDS-7 on the helm. We got HDS-5 on the, the bow. Next okay, we got a Lawrence uh, stereo, and it's all wired together. Uh, and he said he's got adapters for the stereo that'll play any type of phone or device. Um, and then you've got them all wired together uh, via the Lowrance, what's this thing called? Sonic Hub, there you go. Everything wired together with the Lowrance Sonic Hub. So, so that means you've got uh, potential for radar, satellite weather, everything. Um, you can either run video through that uh, through that console right there. All right, so we're starting out the helm. That was the glove box there. It's a watertight glove box. Uh, we've got Yamaha gauges, uh, attack and speed, and then we've got trim and fuel. Uh, down here we got the nav lights, bilge, forward aerator, aft aerator, accessory and horn, and then you got a push button start. Uh, we've got a Yamaha 704 remote. We've got uh, Sea Star hydraulic steering with a nice stainless steel wheel here. Vessel uh, was uh, fully outfitted by the seller here, Keith, and he added these LED lights all over the boat. And along with that Lorance stereo, you got Lorance speakers uh, throughout the vessel, powered by a 600 watt, 800 watt amp. Is that a Lowrance amp? No, it's a. I guess they don't make amps, huh? No, they don't. If they did, it'd be Lowrance. It would be in here. <laughs> the boat is Lowrance. All right, so uh, under here is where everything is, all the goodies. So you got the Sonic Hub, you got two batteries there, you got the, the amp. I don't know, can you see that? There's the amp and the Minn Kota three bank battery charger. Uh, this is a, uh, a bazooka base tube that is not included with the vessel. Uh, he wants to do some rocking in his in his truck. So the latches that came on the ice chest for stainless steel latches. They come with them old plastic ones. Oh wow. Alright so we're back. I had to change the battery. Uh, we've got three jump seats in the back back here. Uh, really nice. Very comfortable. So you could seat uh, five easy uh, for traveling. Seven. Seven? Okay. Put two in the front, two behind the wheel, and three in the back. And uh, Keith also added these swivel ease uh, pedestal mounts back here for bass fishing. And uh, you know, there's one up here that came with the boat, but he added two in the back. Uh, and here's the uh, creme de la creme is the uh, Minn Kota iPilot trolling motor. And uh, tell us what that does. So, tell us what that does. That is GPS guided, anchor lock, remote control, trolling motor, hands free, 80 pound. Nice. Very, very nice. All right, so, so you got other. you got two batteries in the con in the center console. Where's the other battery? In the console. Oh, there's three of them in here. Okay, there's another one. Oh, I got you. So under the jump seat, there's another battery, okay. And there's a kill switch. This is to kill the battery. There you go. So you don't run it dead. Yeah. In storage. And what's under this seat? That is a lock well or a bait well. All right. It has a pump to circulate. Right. And then we got more storage under this right. one. More storage under there. Nice. And what's under the storage? More storage. You got an anchor. Which uh, Keith said he's never used the anchor on the boat because that eye pilot will keep the boat in its position at the touch of a button. And here's actually, the here's the remote right here that you wear around your neck, and uh, that's how you control it. But great feature. I might get one of them for my bay boat. 
All right. So very nice, well laid out, all high end hardware on the boat. It's got everything you need. Ready to go fishing. Got a live well right here. There's another uh, set of speakers. And there's a little cast net compartment down here. You also have access to your bills under that. And then we've got a cooler, ice box, fish box, box, dry storage, and then we've got the rod boxes. Rod boxes on each side for 10, 10 rods maybe. There you go. That's some more on this side, so you fit five on each side. All right. We'll go take a look at the the outside of the boat next. All right, here we're going outside. Uh, nice uh, aluminum trailer got a swing tongue there uh, and of course everything's brand new because the boat only has 50 hours on it um, vessel has a 10 year warranty on the hull and got another 3 years left on the warranty for the motor uh, nice tires big heavy duty axles and you got a swim ladder on the back and there's our uh, Yamaha 150 four stroke. Lifetime hull warranty right there. And this is a Magic Tilt trailer. All right, all officers welcome.